Janui, uh, hi. Janui, can you hear me? Janui, hi. Um, uh, Ma'am said today there is class. Anything like like uh, yesterday it ended or today also there is class? I can't hear you properly. Today there is class, no? Just two minutes, we will start the class. Okay, whether my audio is clear for everyone? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So yesterday we started with the multiple choice questions on uh, plant physiology, which is the most important concept in Karnataka CET as well as in. Today we are going to discuss 
uh, regarding one more plant physiology concept, which is plant growth and development. So we might get around two or three questions, two or three questions on this lesson. Well, it will be very easy. The questions will be very easy, but uh, we have to focus uh, on certain points which are most important. So we are going to discuss around 30 questions. Then we are at last we are going to discuss uh, regarding the most important in the structural organization concept that is anatomy of the flowering plant. So we discussed most important concepts on PU1 and uh, all the topics of PU2. Okay, uh, fine. So let me share the screen and please try to answer through the mic. Just check, can you able to see the screen? Yes? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, now. So plant growth and development, the question start with oxatic growth involves option A, cell division only, option B, cell enlargement only, option C, both A, E only, both A and B, it should be A and B, and D, cell maturation only. Ma'am, option C. Ananya opted for C. What about Janavi and Nayana? Any cases? Ma'am, D. Okay, Nayana said D. So, oxidic growth means what? The growth which occurred due to the production of oxen, which is a plant hormone. So, oxen usually will be present at the tip where growth will be more, no? So, we know that at the tip region, growth will be more, right? So, the tip will be having oxidic growth. So, they asked during the oxidic growth, what the in, uh, internal phenomena occurs? That is, whether it is a cell division, whether it is cell enlargement, that is, change in size, size of a cell, both A and B, or cell maturation, they asked. So Ananya voted for C and Nayana voted for D. So let us see who is correct. So the answer is C. Answer option C. That is cell division as well as cell enlargement. As I said, the growth is concerned at the tip region. There cell division will be at a rapid rate. That is at a very fast rate. As well as cell enlargement will be more. After these two processes only, Cell maturation occurs, which is not in the hands of oxygen. So let us proceed to the next question, which is a requirement of vernalization. Okay. Option A, differentiated tissue. Option B, anaerobic condition. Option C, time factor. Option D, high temperature. Which is a requirement of vernalization. These are the options. Differentiated tissue anaerobic condition, time factor, high temperature. Ma'am, option B. Option B, that is anaerobic condition, okay. Any other answers? Yes, what about Janavi? Fine. So the answer here is option B, that is anaerobic condition. Answer is anaerobic condition. Next question. Point at which growth is maximum in a S-shaped growth curve is called. I repeat. Point at which growth is maximum in a S-shape growth curve. Okay. Extinction point. What it is called as extinction, inflection, check and none of these. Thank 
Ma'am B. Option D, none of these. Okay. What about others? Ma'am, option B. Option B. Inflection point. Fine. Let me check the answer. The answer here is option D, that is none of these. We don't have that term. So which is that term which has a maximum growth? Anyone? Check your books, check your notes. Let me know the answer. Do some work. Point at which growth is maximum in a S-shaped growth curve. Yes, check it and let me know fast. Don't depend on teachers for always. Check it. Who is going to answer first? Yes. Don't guess the answer always. Try to justify the answer. Fourth question. Which of the following promotes flowering in pineapple even in adverse condition of photo period? Photo period means time uh, which is required the for the plant to be uh, exposed to the sunlight. Option A, oxen. Option B, gibberlin. Option C, CK, cytokine. Option D, ethylene. Which of the following promotes flowering in pineapple, they ask. Yes? Ma'am, option A, oxen. Option A, oxen. Ananya answered as option A. Yes? Just a minute. So the answer here is option C, that is cytokinin. Always remember, the pr flower promoting hormone is always cytokinin. Next question, which is a false statement regarding phytochrome? Phytochrome. Option A, absorption spectra in dip is different from chlorophyll. Option B, has open tetrapyrrolic structure. Option C, it is active from it is active form, decreases membrane permeability. Option D, involved in photomorphogenesis. Yes? Who is going to answer first? Exams are near by simply seeing the options and remaining silent what it indicates. Just 
ಜಾನ್ವಿ ನಯನ ಅನನ್ಯ ಭೈರೇಶ್ ದ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಡಿ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ವಾಲ್ವ್ ಇನ್ ಫೋಟೋ ಮಾರ್ಫೋ ಜೆನಸಸ್ ಫೋಟೋ ಮಾರ್ಫೋ ಜೆನಸಸ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ವರ್ನೆಲಿನ್ ಈಸ್ ಕೆಮಿಕಲಿ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ ಟು ಸೈಟೋಕೈನಿನ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಪೋರ್ಟೆಡ್ ಫ್ರೀಲಿ ಅಕ್ರಾಸ್ ಗ್ರಾಫ್ಟ್ ಯೂನಿಯನ್ ಸಿಂಥಸೈಸ್ ಇನ್ ಪ್ಲಾಂಟ್ ರಿಸೀವಿಂಗ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಫೋಟೋ ಪೆರಟ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಡಿ ಇನ್ವಾಲ್ವ್ ಇನ್ ಸ್ಪ್ರಿಂಗಿಫಿಕೇಶನ್ yes who is going to answer first ma'am option c option c synthesized in plant receiving correct photo period varnave okay let me check the answer the right answer is option d involved in springification springification what do you mean by springification so we know that during spring the plants growth will be higher right so chemically similar to uh, vermilion is a hormone okay which ha- which is a chemical which is involved in springification means it modifies the plant to adapt to the spring so what growth should occur inside during the spring season okay seventh question phototopic response in stem tip receiving unidirectional light is not due to phototropic response means what response towards the sunlight in the stem tip okay the stem tip is receiving unidirectional the light in only one direction okay is not due to the act accumulation of auxin on darker side option b destruction of auxin of a lighted side option c increased activity of auxin on illuminated side option d downward translocation of auxin on darker side yes today is the last day of a session especially the biology why you guys are not responding don't take it as granted every question is important at least guess the answer and then answer no whether will you sit quietly in the exam like this only or will you mark any other option whichever comes in your mind ma'am option a option a accumulation of auxin on darker side let me check the right answer is option c that is destruction of auxin of lighted site so what happens they mentioned unidirectional light unidirection means single direction so during that uh, the uh, thing which is exposed or the part which is exposed to only unidirectional light no so their destruction of auxin happens okay so next growth is a irreversible increase in size reversible increase in size reversible increase in shape increases in volume ma'am option a. option a mananya answered as option a any other answers ma'am option d option d increases in volume okay ma'am option a right okay byresh also answered as option a the right answer is option a 
that is irreversible increase in size okay it will not be reversible okay now next question differentiation of conduction tissues of plants takes place under why janu is entering twice or thrice okay differentiation of conduction of tissues of plants takes place under the hormonal control of differentiation means maturation we can say so conduction tissues are xylem and phloem so these maturation of xylem and phloem will be under the control of which hormone they are option a auxin option b brassinosteroid option c aba abscisic acid option d ethylene yes ma'am option d option d nayana answered as option d what about others ma'am option a option a option okay so let me check the answer the answer is option a that is auxin so during that the differentiation will be under the control of a hormone that is auxin okay next okay bushy habit in plants results from bushy habit that is uh, we will see you know certain plants will be bushy pole tara irutte howda so it will be the result of what girdling running defoliation and grafting defoliation means what uh, cutting of leaves periodically so we will see in certain hospitals in certain colleges also where they will maintain the garden okay the gardener will be cutting the Uh, leaves or the twigs of the plant so that they will give a definite shape for some plants so which will appear bushy for the tara anstai rata so defoliation means a loss of leaves you know other uh, meaning girdling pruning and all you know yes ma'am option c ma'am c option c defoliation ananya selected option c Yes. What about others? Okay. So let me check the answer. The right answer is option C. That is defoliation. Then winter wheat variety can be made annual. Annual means uh, it will be available for whole year. Okay. By treatment with MH. treatment with gac that is gibberellic acid a uh, c decapitation d photo inductive cycles yes ma'am option d option d that is decapitation good so let me check the answer the answer is option d treatment with gibberellic acid 3 always remember always remember to change the period of harvesting okay so we will use gibberellic acid in varieties of crops especially wheat okay gibberellic acid touch me not plant show pygmotropism okay sismonasty Sigmonasty, haptonasty. Touch me not plant. We know mutti jare muni. Okay, when you just touch it, the leaves will fold. Why they those will fold? 
which type of tropism it will show they ask ma'am option b option b sismo nasty so sismo means touch okay nasty means response so response to touch will be shown by mimosa pudica that is touch me not plant okay now phototropism was discovered in oat rice canary grass maize ma'am option c option c canary grass okay let me check the answer the right answer is option c that is canary grass okay na next question vernilin was discovered by uh, lenesco garner gasner and mulcher ma'am option d ananya said option d any other answers ma'am option d option b garner okay let me check what about janvi and tyresh option d ma'am option d mulcher okay so the right answer is option a lesson co okay lesson co discovered vernalin lesson co okay lesson kelu co means a friend lesson co remember like this cartilagan discovered by phytochrome cytochrome okay cartilagan he is a chinese scientist okay discovered phytochrome cytochrome for fluorogen and ethylene ma'am option c ananya answered option c option c ma'am okay let me check the answer the right answer is option c that is flor florigen very good next question the application of which hormone delays senescence in plants that is cell death okay senescence means cell death ethylene option b auxin option c gibberellic acid option d cytokinins ma'am option d option d cytokinin ananya said option d okay let me check the answer the right answer is option d that is cytokinin which delays the senescence or the cell death of a plant good next question in liverworts and algae okay liverworts are the uh, part uh, sorry classification in bryophytes we will get liverworts okay example of bryophytes uh, and algae abscisic acid is functionally similar to oxenolimic acid linularic acid tri iodo benzoic acid cis sequiter pen ma'am option b option d ma'am b option b okay any other answers the right answer is option b that is linoleic acid 
the growth of plant differs from growth of animal is be in being diffuse localized localized and diffuse uniform andre sasyadallina belavanige mattu praniyallina belavanige hege differ agutte anta kelidare first one is diffused agutto spread aagirutto growth localized one day party ge concern agirutto one day party convert concern agi like one day party concentrate agi diffuse andre spread aagta irutto athwa uniform agirutto how it differs how the growth of plant okay nayana answered as option d that is uniform okay ma'am d ananya also voted for d okay let me check the answer the answer is option b that is localized the growth of plant will be at the same part branch andre branch grow agutte root andre root grow agutte so after that what happens it will not spread like a animal so b is localized which one of the following is used to improve quality of vegetable crops by inhibiting flower formation inhibiting means by opposing the flower formation option a n a a m please note down these and find the full form of these okay then because adanu kelbodu b chlorophenoxy propionic acid option c c c c option d 2 4 5 t question is quality of vegetable crops na increase madodakke yavudanna use martivi anta any answers ma'am option ananya voted for b okay let me check the answer the answer is option b next 20th question perennial plants where the apical meristem continue to produce new buds and leaves show perennial plants where the apical meristem continue to produce new buds and leaves show shoot senescence synchronous senescence sequential senescence simultaneous senescence perennial plants perennial plants means what what do you mean by perennial plants whose life span is more than 2 years tumba varshagala prakala but perennial anta antare so adralli apical meristem yavaglu enagirutte it will be undergoing the division and it will be active to produce new buds and leaves so idu hege cell death ana torusutte shoot senescence andre branch athwa kombe galu death aagthava synchronous senescence all at a time agutta sequential that is root then stem then leaf agutta simultaneous ella onde time ge aagta iratta anta mam option c option c okay alanya said option c nayana also voted for option c so let me check the answer the right answer is option c that is sequential senescence good next question oxytic growth is okay so here options the first question is similar to this but the options here are quite changed in the form of a sentence okay sentence also changed oxytic growth is growth involving cell division only growth involving cell enlargement only growth involving both cell division and cell enlargement growth without cell division and cell enlargement 
Yes, what is the answer? Um, C. Option C. Growth involving both cell division and cell enlargement. Okay. So here, it should not be D, it should be C. So it is growth involving both cell division and cell enlargement. Then, 22nd question. Respiratory, climatic and enrichment line effect are due to, okay, ethylene and MH respectively, ethylene and cytokinin respectively, cytokinin only, abscisic acid and indolectic acid respectively. Ma'am, option D. Option? Ma'am, D. Option D. Okay, let me check the answer. The right answer is option B, that is ethylene and cytokinin respectively. Next question. Sarcinate vernation of cycas and fern leaves in young condition. Sarcinate vernation and tandre. When you see a quite tip region of the new, yaude uh, vandu plant, especially cycas, or chick plant, ali, shrubs, ali, au chick didaga, leaves twig na nodidre, front portion na nodidre, au hi sutkondrate valagade. Okay, coil thara sutkondrate. So that is sarcinate vernation. Oh, one minute. Like this. So this is called sarcinate vernation. Okay. So here they are asking why sarcinate vernation? How the sarcinate vernation? Just a minute. Huh? Okay. Now it is due to nasty movement, ephemeral movement, tactic movement, turgor movement. Turgor movement means entering of uh, the water inside and outside of the cell. Turgor, rigid cells. Near ho, near ho, alagane ho da ga cells hai ga jirate. Turgor, that is turgid da jirata vay ho da. So, adar, yao du karna antha keel gare sar, sinit varnation hai. Which might be the option? Ma'am, option D. Option D, turgor movement. Any other answers? Hmm. Yes, Nayana? Ma'am, B. B. Ephemeral movement. Okay. So let us check the answer. The answer is A, that is nasty movement. It is due to nasty movement. Next. Differentiation of tissues and organs is controlled by. Differentiation means maturation of primary tissues and organs into secondary or permanent tissues. So it is controlled by which hormones? Auxins and GA, auxins and CK, GA and CK, auxins only. Um, option D. Option D, auxins only. Okay. Any other answers? Okay. So let me check the answer. The right answer here is option B. That is auxins and cytokinin. Auxins and cytokinin. Richmond Lang effect is related with substituting cold treatment. Option D. Bolting. Option C. Feminizing effect. Option D. Delaying senescence. Ma'am, 
Ma'am D. Option D. Delaying senescence. Any other answers? So the right answer here is option D that is delay in senescence. Right answer. Okay, good. Bioassay for cytokinin is cotyledon expansion test, triple response test, split P stem curvature test, dwarf maze test. Ma'am B. Ma'am B. Okay, B and D. Let me check the option. Option A, that is cortilodon expansion test is the right answer. The growth movements in which direction of response is determined by the structure of response, responsive region is. I repeat, the growth movement in which the direction of response is determined by the structure of responsive region is. Option A, nutation. Option B, tropic movements. Option C, nastic movements. Option D, tactic movements. Ma'am, option C. Option C. Right answer is option C. Very good, both of you. Next question. Which of the following hormones causes elongation in intact plants? Okay, now. Option A, oxygen. Option B, cytokinin. Option C, gibberlin. Option D, abscisic acid. Ma'am, option B. Option B, cytokinin. Okay. Ma'am, A. A. Let me check the answer. The right answer is C. That is gibberlin. Okay, not A or B. So what is the question? Elongation. When you get the term that is elongation related question, the answer will be Gibberlin. Next question. Periulic acid is the inhibitor of seed germination found in. Means it will not allow the seed to germinate. It is found in which plant they ask? Tobacco, xanthium, tomato and apple. A and B. Okay. The right answer is C. That is tomato. 30th question. Start statolic theory was proposed to explain the mechanism of geotropism, epinasty, phototropism, seismonasty. Ma'am, option A. Option A, geotropism. Okay. Okay, let me check the answer. The right answer here is option A, that is geotropism. Okay, now, just a minute. Okay. So, we discussed regarding product growth and development. So, in this lesson, you have to concentrate mainly on maize, uh, that is, tropism, phototropism, sigmotropism, seismonasty, okay, seismonasty and all, okay. Now, we will discuss regarding the anatomy of flowering plants, okay, anatomy of flowering plants. Just give me two minutes, I will open the document and let you know.
Just check. Can you able to see the screen? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. The first question is: Tracheids differ from other tracheary elements. Tracheids, we know, we know tracheary elements. Both are the components of xylem. So these will differ from one another from having a casparium strips. B being imperforate. C lacking the nucleus. D being lignified. Um, option C. Lacking nucleus. Okay. Okay. Any other answers? Let me check the answer. The right answer is option B. Being imperforate means. Tracheids only perforations here all that. So, at the end, we hold that kind of thing, right? So, those will be not there in tracheids. They will we will observe them in tracheary elements. Companion cells are closely associated with option A guard cells, option B vessel elements, option C trichomes, option D seed elements. Yes, what are they? Option D, sieve elements. Okay. Any other answers? Ma'am, option D. Okay. So the right answer is option D. That is sieve elements. Good. Next question. Age of a tree can be estimated by biomass, number of annual rings, diameters of its heartwood, its height and girth. Ma'am, B. B number of annual rings. Okay. Any other answers? Mum D. D. It's height answer. So let us check the answer. Option B. That is number of iron annual rings is a right answer. Next question. Lenticels are involved in option A photosynthesis. Option B gaseous exchange. Option C, transpiration. Option D, food transport. My meaning of lenticels, what? Ah, uh, lenticels are nothing but these are like a stomata, which we will you will observe in a secondary wood. My option C. Option C, transpiration. It will be like stomata. I said it is not a stomata. And uh, this one, mm. Ananya said option B. Let us check. The right answer is option B. That is gaseous exchange. Lengthy sense diagram is an insect book. Can you note about it? So, only in agriculture, it will be totally open uh, than compared to stomata. Stomata, yawaaga dro open agi na gatte yawaaga close aga the. It is due to the concentration gradient, opening and closing of stomata, right? So, lengthy cells are different. So they are involved in gaseous exchange. Okay, now common bottle cork is the product of xylem, phloogen, dermato dermatogen, then vascular cambium. Mum D. Mum D. Phloogen. Okay, B dermato dermatogen, D vascular cambium. So the right answer here is a uh, common bottle cork. So as it is a cork, the right answer is phloogen. The cork cambium, cork and secondary cortex are collectively called phloem, phloogen, phloodum, peridum. My option B. Option B, phloogen. The right answer is option D. Periderm, cork cambium, cork, matter secondary cortex. Muru seri adi ke nanta kari tar hai. Periderm nanta kari tar hai. Heartwood differs from sapwood in being susceptible to pests and pathogens, presence of rays and fibers, absence of vessels and parenchyma, having dead and non-conducting elements. Ah, 
ಹಾರ್ಟ್ವುಡ್ ಮತ್ತೆ ಸ್ಯಾಪ್ವುಡ್ಗೆ ಏನ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆನ್ಸ್ ಎದ್ರಲ್ಲಿ ಡಿಫ್ರೆನ್ಸ್ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಲೀಂಗ್ ಸಸೆಪ್ಟೇಬಲ್ ಟು ಪೆಸ್ಟ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಪ್ಯಾಥೋಜನ್ಸ್ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಹಾರ್ಟ್ ವುಡ್ಗೆ ಬೇಗ ಪೆಸ್ಟ್ ಮತ್ತೆ ಪ್ಯಾಥೋಜನ್ಸ್ ಅಟ್ಯಾಕ್ ಆಗ್ತವೆ ಪ್ರೆಸೆನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರೇಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಫೈಬರ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ಸೈಡ್ ದ ಹಾರ್ಟ್ ವುಡ್ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ವೆಸಲ್ ಸೈಲಮ್ ಮತ್ತೆ ಪ್ಯಾರಂಟೈಮ್ ಅಂದಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಡೆಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ನಾನ್ ಕಂಡಕ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಎಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಐಸ್ ದ ಪ್ರೆಸೆನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರೇಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಫೈಬರ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ದ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಡಿ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಡೆಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ನಾನ್ ಕಂಡಕ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ Eighth question, anatomically fairly old dicotyledonous root is distinguished from the dicotyledonous stem by, means uh, indirectly they are asking what is the difference between dicotyledonous root and stem anatomically. And the anatomy and the internal structure wise in difference one. Okay, that. Absence of secondary phloem, presence of cortex, position of protoxylum, absence of secondary xylem. ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟಿಕಲ್ಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಹೇಳಿರ್ತಾರೆ ಇದೆ ನಿಮ್ಗೆ ಮ್ಯಾಮ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಬಿ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಬಿ ಪ್ರೆಸೆನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಾರ್ಟೆಕ್ಸ್ ಮ್ಯಾಮ್ ಎ ಲೆಟ್ ಮೀ ಚೆಕ್ ದ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ದ ರೈಟ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಸಿ ಪ್ರೋಟೋಸೈಲಮ್ ಮತ್ತೆ ಮೆಟಾಸೈಲಮ್ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳಿದ್ದೀನಿ ಸೊ ಅದರ ಬಿ ಪೊಸಿಷನ್ ಮೇಲೆ ಮೊದ್ಲು ಪ್ರೋಟೋಸೈಲಮ್ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಮೆಟಾಸೈಲಮ್ ಮೊದ್ಲು ಮೆಟಾಸೈಲಮ್ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಪ್ರೋಟೋಸೈಲಮ್ ಸೊ ಇದರ ಪೊಸಿಷನ್ಸ್ ಮೇಲೆ ಏನಾಗತ್ತೆ ಆ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಸ್ಟೆಮ್ ಅಥವಾ ರೂಟ್ ಉದ್ದು ಅಂತ ಗೊತ್ತಾಗತ್ತೆ ಸೊ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಸಿ ಇಸ್ ದ ರೈಟ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಆನ್ಯುಲರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸ್ಪೈರಲ್ ಥಿಕ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಕಂಡಕ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಜನರಲಿ ಡೆವಲಪ್ ಇನ್ ಪ್ರೋಟೋಸೈಲಮ್ ವೆನ್ ರೂಟ್ ಆರ್ ಸ್ಟೆಮ್ ಈಸ್ ಸೊ ಕಂಡಕ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಥಿಕನಿಂಗ್ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಅಂತ ಗೊತ್ತು ಎಸ್ಪೆಷಲಿ ಇನ್ ದ ಸೈಲಮ್ ಸೊ ಆ ಥಿಕನಿಂಗ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಅಗೇನ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಮೆನಿ ಟೈಪ್ ಆನ್ಯುಲರ್ ಸ್ಪೈರಲ್ ಪರ್ಫೋರೇಟೆಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ಸೊ ಆನ್ಯುಲರ್ ಮತ್ತೆ ಸ್ಪೈರಲ್ ಥಿಕನಿಂಗ್ ಇದ್ದಾಗ ಯಾವಾಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ಯಾವ ಕಂಡೀಷನ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಅದು ರೂಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲೂ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಸ್ಟೆಮ್ ಅಲ್ಲೂ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಬಟ್ ಯಾವಾಗ ಯಾವ ಕಂಡೀಷನ್ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಡಿಫ್ರೆನ್ಶಿಯೇಟ್ ಆಗುವಾಗಿರುತ್ತಾ ಎಲಾಂಗೇಟಿಂಗ್ ಉದ್ದವಾಗುವಾಗಿರುತ್ತಾ ವೈಡನಿಂಗ್ ಅಗಲವಾಗುವಾಗಿರುತ್ತಾ ಮೆಚ್ಯೂರಿಂಗ್ ಮೆಚ್ಯೂರ್ ಆಗುವಾಗಿರುತ್ತಾ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳಿದ್ದಾರೆ So, what is the option? Ma'am, option C. Widening. The right answer is option B, that is elongating. For a cortical study of secondary growth in plants, which one of the following pair is suitable? Wheat and maiden hair fern, sugar cane and sunflower, tea can pine, deodar and fern. Cortical study. ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಸೆಕೆಂಡರಿ ಗ್ರೋತ್ ಅನ್ನ ಕಾರ್ಟೆಕ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಮಾಡೋದಕ್ಕೆ ಯಾವ ಕೇಳಿದಾರೆ ಅವರು ಯಾವ ಪೇರ್ ಇದ್ರಲ್ಲಿ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ದ ಟೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಬುಕ್ ವಿಚ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಹಾಕಿದೆ ವೀಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಮೇಜನ್ ಹೇರ್ ಫರ್ ಓಕೆ ದ ರೈಟ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಸಿ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಸಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಫೈನ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ Tomato in grass leaf are rectangular, dumbbell shaped, kidney shaped, barrel shaped. Mambi. Dumbbell shaped. So as we know that grass are the monocots. So in monocot we can observe the stomata in the shape of dumbbell, not a kidney shape. So the answer is option B, that is dumbbell shaped. Cortex is the region found between. Cortex is the region found between. Epidermis and steel. Pericycle and endodermis. Endodermis and spit. Endodermis and vascular bundles. Well, option D. Ananya, option D. Nayana? Well, what about you? Option A. So the right answer is option A, that is epidermis, but the steel is the mass of cells. So the mass is the cortex. Next question. Specialized epidermal cells surrounding the guard cells. Guard cells are the specialized epidermal cells. What is it? Complementary cells, bully form cell, lenty cell, subsidiary cell. Ma'am D. Ma'am D. The right answer is option D, that is subsidiary cells. Good. Now, 
Vascular bundle in monocotyledons are considered closed because xylem is surrounded all around phloem. Bundle sheet surrounds each bundle. KMDM is absent. There are no vessels with perforation. Vascular bundles are no tumba types. Closed and open type of vascular bundle. So in monocots, uh, we will uh, say closed vascular bundle. So what do you mean by closed vascular bundle? Anta keli daraoru indirect type. So what is the answer? Mam C. Okay. C. Very good. The right answer is option C. That is KMDM is absent. Absent algebra closed on the kritare. Uh, present in the open on the kritare. Closed vascular bundles lack. Closed vascular bundles ali e irodilla. Pit conjunctive tissue KMDM ground tissue. Both questions are related. Mam C. Okay. So let me check the answer. The right answer is option C. That is KMDM. Good. Next question. Ground tissue includes all tissues internal to endodermis. Ground tissue and rain on the kelly. All tissue external to endodermis. All tissue except epidermis and vascular bundle. Epidermis and cortex. D. D. Epidermis and cortex. Okay. Ananya, what about you? Mam C. Let me check the answer. The right answer is option C. That is all tissues except epidermis mathe vascular bundles. In a land plants, the guard cells differ from other epidermal cells in having chloroplast, cytoskeleton, mitochondria, endoplasmic reticulum. So, epidermal cells are rectangular, guard cells are kidney shape. That is, epidermal cells and guard cells are difference. If they are male in the other, means they will form the first layer. But to what is the difference they ask? Chloroplastal difference, cytoskeleton, mitochondria, ER. What is the answer? Mam, yeah. Very good. The right answer is option A, that is chloroplast. Good. Next one. Some vascular bundles are described as open because possess conjunctive tissue between xylem and phloem, not surrounded by pericycle. Surrounded by pericycle but no epidermis are capable of producing secondary xylem and phloem. KMBM present open and so, KMDM function in a munde. So, our options and a cotti there. So, our option correct option is that. So, you have the option one, then you select Marbic. Mam C. Okay, and an answer does C. The right answer is option D. KMDM present in the Galena that the KMDM cells again they will undergo cell division to produce secondary xylem and phloem. So, KMDM present in the open type. KMDM present in the function function, they will produce secondary xylem and phloem. So, that is the answer. Option D is the answer. The chief water conducting elements of xylem in gymnosperms are brachids, fibers, vessels, transfusion, tissue. Mami. Mami. Okay, both of you selected A. Option A is the right answer. Which one of the following is not a lateral meristem? Uh, okay, intercalary meristem, intrafesicular meristem, interfesicular cambium, uh, intrafesicular cambium, option D, fellowship. Mami. Intercalary meristem, good. So all of three, intrafesicular, interfesicular, mate cambium. Oh, sorry, Mathe Fellogen. So, these are responsible for width of a Vela and Tabandaga, lateral meristem involve, involvement in their effect. So, intercalary and Tabandaga in Udda, Udda Vagate plant. It is concerned with length of a plant. So, that is the right answer. Option A, 21st. Casparian strips occur in Casparian strips. A cortex, B epidermis, uh, sorry. 
बी एपिडर्मिस सी सॉरी 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 ए कॉर्टेक्स बी पेरिसाइकल सी एपिडर्मिस डी एंडोडर्मिस मैम डी The right answer is endodermis. That is D. Twenty second question. A major characteristic of monocot root. Monocot root only important characteristic. Kya udu? Anta kele tar. A. Ambium sandwiched between phloem and xylem. B. Open vascular bundle. C. Scattered vascular bundle. D. Vasculature without ambium. राइट आंसर इज डी वैक्सुलेचर विदउट एम नेक्स्ट ट्वेंटी थर्ड क्वेश्चन एज कंपेर टू अट रूट मोनोकॉट रूट हाज मोर अबंडन सैकेंडरी जैलम मेनी जैलम बंड इनकॉन्स्टिक्यूस आनुअल रिंग रिटिवली What about you, Nayana? Ma'am, D. The right answer is option B. In monocots, we can observe many xylem bundles. Next one. The water-containing cavities in vascular bundles occur in sunflower, B. Pinus, C. Maize, D. Cycas. एंडोडर्मिस ऑफ रूट फॉर क्विक ट्रांसपोर्ट ऑफ वॉटर फ्रॉम कॉर्टिक्स टू पेरिसाइकल good option d is the right answer 26 transport of food material in higher plants transfusion tissue sieve elements companion cells tracheids mam d d tracheids b b b okay anayana uh, said b the right answer is option b that is sieve elements sieve elements phloem ge relate agide phloem in transport madakke food anna xylem water is related to this so tracheids and transport made up the water so the right answer is b sieve elements secondary xylem and phloem in dicot stem are produced by phylogen epical meristem vascular cambium axillary meristem mam c mam c okay very good the right answer is vascular cambium that is c Plants having little or no secondary growth. Now, what can I tell you? Conifers, deciduous angiosperms, grasses, cycads. Mambi. Right answer is grasses. The vascular cambium normally gives rise to phloem. Secondary xylem, primary phloem, periderm. Mummy. 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 Answer is option B. Secondary xylem, cambium. Or secondary xylem, mana produce mana. Which of the following is made up of dead cell? Xylem, parenchyma, colon, thyma, phloem, and phloem. Mummy. Mummy. Parenchyma is a living mechanical tissue. Xylem parenchyma is also living. Then phloem is also living, uh, uh, except some phloem fibers. Then the right answer is option C, that is phloem. Next one. Identify the wrong statements in context of Hartwood. Hartwood related to wrong statement. Yeah, who? Organic compounds are deposited in it. Highly durable. Conducts water and minerals. Comprises of dead elements with highly lignified walls. Mam C. Mam D. 
answer is option C. It conducts water and minerals. How to do dead dark earth? So it will not conduct much. So option C is the right answer. The balloon shaped structure called tylosis are linked to ascent of sap through xylem, originate in the lumen of vessels. Characteristic of the saput are extension of xylem, xylem parenchyma cells into the vessels. Option C, that is the right answer. Okay, next. You are given fairly old piece of dicot stem and dicot root. You have dicot stem and dicot root. Which of the following anatomical structure, uh, anatomy structure node, you have a difference between the dicot stem and dicot root. And the secondary xylem, the protoxylem, the secondary phloem, the cortical cells. You have a new condition, the dicot root. मतलब ये तो डाइकोट स्टेम अंता एनाटॉमिकली है कंडीडी की रांटा केली दारा मंबी प्रोटोजाइलम वेरी गुड द करेक्ट आंसर इज पोजीशन ऑफ प्रोटोजाइलम फाइन सो टुडे वी कंप्लीटेड ऑल द इंपोर्टेंट कॉन्सेप्ट रिलेटेड टू द सीटी ऑफ बायोलॉजी कर्नाटका सीटी ऑफ बायोलॉजी एस वेल एस द नीट ओके so I hope the exams are nearby. You are preparing well. Don't take tension and be prepared for the exam. If you don't know the answer, just leave it at that minute. Okay? And give one minute for each question. If you cross one minute, leave that question and answer the other one. Later, when you get the time, then guess the answer and then uh, mark the options. Okay? And before going to exam, please don't read at least uh, one hour before. एग्जाम और एक होगो और वो उत्तर कुछ को बेडी वन अवर और वन एंड हाफ अवर है किरबे कल्ला नहीं वो निम्न के एग्जाम से इलापा नो रीति रबे देन नोली यू कैन रिमेम्बर द कॉन्सेप्ट यू होगो एग्जाम और होगो और वो अब ब्रो ऑल टिकेट सुपरवाइजर बरो और वो बुक के कौन कुछ कौन डरता है सो दैट विल व्हाट इट � no clock in the exam in the past on the read until 10 8 okay read until 8 and then close the book and the budget in there man buddy just prepare for the exam get ready and take the hall ticket and all the other documents and go amele don't go with the over brigger at the other uh thin betray no path in do or this much if in mark on uta mark on only the barat in why can't answer in on the please eat food drink water and then go Weakness, yavag barate, heg barate, especially for the girls. And take uh, preferably ball pen to mark in you know, a OMR sheet or a black pen. Our health are answered, you will be having an instruction. Because gel pen, Andre, sometimes you will use waterproof gel pen also, but uh, risk so better use uh, ball pen, okay, to mark the OMR sheet and be sure. OMR sheet one copy नी विट को बेको इन्नों ने copy आउरी कोट बर बेको यार दोनों नी में तो कौन ढोक बेडी तो कौन बर बेडी complications आ गत्ते exam time में ली confusion आ गया आ गत्ते तो supervisor इन हेल्प करो तो ना नी टा गर्था मार कौन दो then give the OMR sheet question paper नी मात्रा इरत्ते नी दो वन दो OMR copy carbon copy नी मात्रा नहीं इरत्ते okay so I hope whatever we discuss regarding the previous year question paper will be helpful for everyone. Helpful I thought in other Yes ma'am. Okay, yes, don't waste the time. Okay, don't worry, don't waste the time. Be confident. I am confident that you all will do well and uh, I will be waiting to see you all as a future doctors to treat me or as a engineers. Okay, meet you all in uh, or more successful colors and please let me know the result if anything ane adru please let us know okay new tumba chanage matiranta gotti there but results ban mele namana mari baby okay uh, don't forget the teachers or the uncles we all will be waiting for your result tumba curiosity irutte ni veno helthirappa result anta namke na don't hurt us okay 
so it is just the emotional attachment between the teachers and students we will be waiting for the result of everyone i think nale result idala nimdu pu do no ma'am 12th alva no ma'am no ma'am okay okay then uh, when results come please let me know to the mail or the whatsapp number okay na number illa andru neevu bere ma'am appa sorry kelidru avaru nanu kelthare okay ma'am uh, okay i will miss you all take care have a very bright future bye 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 ma'am